Find the Vishanti, I welcome you all here. I am Dr. Strange, a master of the mystic arts. I have sensed that each of you hold the potential to one day harness and become one with the energy of this world. I, like many of you, used to be unaware of the existence of the multiverse, realities that are different from our own. But if you learn to open your inner sight and believe in that which you do not know, you too may be able to see beyond this world into the next. I was trained in the ways of the mystic arts by the Ancient One, the Sorcerer Supreme, at a place called Kamartaj, on the other side of this world. By training alongside accomplished masters, I learned to control and manipulate reality. And I am here today for your initial training. Now, before we begin, I must ask you all to forget everything you think you know, and to believe the impossible. You think you can do that? I thought so. Now, before we contemplate the other realities of the multiverse, we must be confident and comfortable here in our own. And it all starts with standing, which you're already doing. You're off to a great start. There's always room for a fire, though. Those of you auditing the class, you're more than welcome to participate if you'd like. Stand with your feet apart. Stand tall, strong, and proud. Let your arms hang down by your side. Good. Good. This comes naturally to you. Just stand with your feet just a little wider. Like this. Very good. You catch on quickly. Now, I'll ask you all to close your eyes. Try to access your inner sense. The third eye, if you will, sees what is not clear. What is in the multiverse beyond? Let go. Feel the current. Did you hear that? Very good. Close your eyes. Concentrate. Feel the energy of the multiverse around you. Breathe deeply. Yes, you sense that. You are looking into another reality. Hear the whispers of other forms of us. All it is that we hear. Great power. All among us. You may open your eyes. Now, the first thing you need to know about the mystic arts is that the language of the mystic arts, which is as old as civilization, is known as spells, which can be found in books like the Book of the Vishanti. Training to use these spells takes time, years of practice, and a great deal of dedication. You must learn to focus your thoughts focuses your body, which focuses your spirits. Once you have mastered this skill, you will be able to harness the energy of the multiverse and use that energy to cast spells. Now, I would like to see all of you harness the energy of the multiverse. Again, stand with your feet wide, look here, focus. Concentrate on the book of the Vishanti. Feel the energy from the multiverse growing inside of you. Good. Focus your thoughts. Focus your bodies. Focus your spirits. Very good. I knew I sensed potential in all of you. Now, the mystic arts is more than just making things move or traveling from world to world. There are dangerous things out there, and we need to know how to protect ourselves and battle evil. The Mists of Munapur is a very handy spell to know. It is a defensive spell that can be used to create a mist to distract or disorient an enemy. I will show you how to cast the spell, then we will practice it together. 
Fists of Moonaborn. Repeat after me. This of Moonapol. Good. There you are. Repeat after me. We'll try this one more time. Mists of Moonapol. Now you speak loudly. Say it clearly. Mists of Moonapol. Good. Good. I think we've had enough practice. I think. Ready to help me cast a spell? I'm What's your name? Tyler? Tyler. Stand here. Widen your stance. Feel the energy of the multiverse. Concentrate. Focus your thoughts, your body, and your spirit. Okay. Say it with me. Miss I'll help you. Control the spirit. There you are. Feel the energy of the multiverse. Yes. Very good. Good. Very good. Such great potential. Yes. Show everyone what you have there. You have formed an icy token of Ichthalon, a very advanced spell. Yes, you should be proud of yourself. I knew you had the potential for greatness. Keep the icy token of Ichthalon safe if it starts to squirm or sprout tendrils. You're doing it right. Stand right around. If the icy token is too icy, yes, Paul. Thank you. Very good. I thought you all might be great masters one day. Let's all try casting a spell together. The Winds of Watu. It's a very handy spell. This is an offensive spell. It can be used to push an enemy away or to levitate or move objects from a distance. This is a powerful spell, so we'll have... We'll shift slightly back. There we are. Very good. Very good. Now again, I will show you how to cast the spell. And then we will practice. Place your hands in front. Make a circle back toward yourself. And press forward with your left hand, bringing your right hand back. One circle. And press. Good. Good. Now the words that go along with it. Repeat after me. Winds of Watu. Now you. Winds of Watu. Good. Say it clearly. Again. Winds of Watu. Good, good. Feel the energy come from within. Focus your thoughts, your bodies, and your spirits. Again, cast the spell. I can't hear you. Focus. Focus on the crystal. Go on. Cast the spell one more time. Winds of Watu. Of Watu. Good, good. Hold it there. Focus. Feel the energy coming from within you. Good. Good. Yes, reach out into the multiverse. Feel the energy. Good. Very good. Very good. Yes. I knew I sensed greatness in all of you. This is a very challenging spell, one that took me a very long time to, to master. It can be very, very impressed with yourselves. You sense that? Seems we have drawn too much attention to ourselves. Perhaps we should not be seen in the open, so many students of the mystic arts. You've made brilliant progress in your studies. I have no doubt that all of you may well become masters one day. Perhaps there may even be the next Sorcerer Supreme. Yes. I suppose it might be. Well, we have a round of applause for our new students of the mystic arts. Thank you, accolades. And of course, there, can, uh, well, there can't be any great students without a great master or doctor. Woo! Now, before you depart, I have a token of what you've learned today. The seal of the Vishanti, as I said, manifests itself only to those who are truly gifted in the mystic arts. Come forward one at a time, and I will give you 
his seat. What's your name? Right there. Thank you, well done, Mr. Ross. And you said this was your first lesson? Okay. So this is going to be very powerful. Very powerful. You want to study the offense of the defense? The defense is... 